This is a screencast on how to analyse text by making connections. The recipe for success in this is you need to do two main things. You need to connect to other texts that you have read and you need to connect to experiences that you have had. Those are the two main things. So as we read this text, you'll be able to remind yourself of the things. Um, this is the brainstorm we did at the beginning with the picture of the guy back man. You can see the ideas that were put around the outside. You guys had made connections in this to begin with because this shows the understanding and you were already comparing it to what you already knew about bad man. Okay, for instance, his mask was broken, he was wearing a jacket and you were saying that he didn't wear a jacket in real life. His utility belt might not be as well equipped as the TV version and he hasn't had to fight Penguin's henchmen yet but Zoltan Kahari has nailed the superhero look and grit needed to fight evil in the southern Slovak town of Dunajska Strada. Dressed in his homemade all leather Batman costume with the bat symbol proudly displayed on his chest and pointy ears on his cowl, Kahari 26 cleans the streets, helps old people out and calls the police when he sees something suspicious. I've decided to do good for the people. I take care of order and help clean up the environment so we can keep living on this planet, Kahari told Reuters. There are some slight differences in the storylines in the real life Kahari and the fictional millionaire Bruce Wayne, the man behind the mask in the Batman comic books, TV shows and films. So we've noted in here that his cow, which we've circled just over here, Cal is actually the mask that he wears. Fernando identified that from the pointy ears piece. We identified that he lives in Slovakia, which is a country in Europe. And we also notice, remembered that we made that connection that the penguin was a bad guy, because some of you had seen him in the other films. For one, Kahari is a real life person whose path... whose path to the side of truth, justice and, t and a tidy enough were once strayed to the wrong side of the law. The trained house painter spent eight months in jail last year and attempted suicide after he was released before realising he had a mission to make life in his community better. Lacking a full-time job, he moved into a dilapidate, dilapidated concrete apartment block on the edge of town where he turned an empty apartment with no electricity or running water, into his very own back cave from which where he launches, launches his street patrols. Kohari's Batman impersonation follows the emergence of a trend in the United States where ordinary citizens began donning superhero costumes and performing public services in the wake of Hollywood films such as Kick-Ass and Woody Harrison's Defendor, which tell the tale of real-life superheroes. Now, if we go back to dilapidate, Dilapidated, it means broken, run down. Um, we also said that he's different from the real Batman because the real Batman is not interested in the environment while Kahari is very much interested in helping the environment. Kahari says he never resorts to physical violence and some people in the town think he's a bit batty. But his neighbours said he is as honest and honest good man. He's had a tough life but he is very dependable and we like him. He helps us out keeps an eye on the public order, and he is a hero for my son and his schoolmates, said Jana Kosakasova, a mother of two who lives in a neighbouring apartment block. So where's the next Slovak superhero? After tidying up and helping the elderly, Batman's next mission will be making sure the bouncers at the local disco do not rough up the visitors.